Let's play a game, shall we? Well, hello there, folks, and welcome to Pokemon Plat- Uranium, I'm sorry. I keep confusing them. Pokemon Uranium, yes. Did you see that new building? That's the Tandor subway. They have just finished it here, and a new touch as well. That's the best way to travel to distant towns now. So, they finally finished it, huh? Hello, fisherman. It's almost impossible to find Pokemon swimming on the lake's surface. Most of them are next to the lake's bottom. Probably, I don't know. I don't know enough to contradict you on that, so... I'm just gonna take your word for it and run off. Oh, hello. You might be asking, what's a policeman doing here just looking at flowers? The thing is that this town is so peaceful and perfect that I don't have anything to do while working. I even get paid for that. Oh, good for that. Well... I mean, you're like a wall if you're doing your job, nobody will even notice that you're there. Ever since I can, ever since I enrolled my kids at the school here, I've had peace and quiet. My soap operas are on today, I need to find out if Louis' plot to disguise himself as his twin, Louis, will be busted or not. Cute. Borlo's subway is still under construction, however, you can't use it yet. I'm guarding the metro station today, a bit more interesting than what my partner is doing. Okay, which is doing the same thing. The truth is that this town is so peaceful that I don't even ha that I don't have anything to do. Hey, welcome to Lisa's Rustic Shop. Would you like to check our store? Sure. How may I serve you? Energy powder. A very bitter medicine. It restores the HP of one Pokemon by 50 points. Restores the HP by 200 points. A very bitter medicine. It heals the status problems of a single Pokemon. Oh, I'm aware of that. Please come again. Bye-bye. Cute. Cute kid. Oh, okay, here we go. This is how you go forward in this game. <laughs> huh. Okay. Wait, are my Pokemon healed? I'm guessing they're not. I'm guessing they're a little rusty. Oh, no. They're fine. They good. Everything's all good in the hood. Although I should probably save just in case. Even though I already did. That's just how paranoid I get sometimes. Okay. Oh, uh, you don't want to fight? Hey, keep distance from Comet Cave. Pokemon there are attacking in groups. It's really dangerous to go through it alone. Is this going to be one of those that's dangerous to go alone? I love to hide in this tall grass. I was about to say, is this going to be one of those that's dangerous to go alone Take these mo take this moments? But the school kid kind of ruined the mood. School kid Marta brought out Kenneth Monk. Okay. Cool. Here's my Lombre. You'll absorb all your power. Okay. Good for you. You feeling you feeling special? You want a cookie? Don't you want a cookie? Oh wow, that's that barely did anything. Seriously? Get that weak crap out of here. It paralyzed it. It paralyzed it too. We're the same level. How is there this much of a discrepancy? This is bull. You know what? Forget it. Going crazy, Diamond. Kick, kick the crap out of it. You've got a fighting type move, and I'm pretty sure it's still a normal type, or at least part of a normal type. Good for you. I guess that charge really does do, does give an extra kick to it, doesn't it? Mud slap, maybe. Right, because it's not ground, it's not immune. That's unfortunate. It's super effective, and yet, it does very little. Yeesh. This is ridiculous. Seriously? Yeah, seriously. I guess my only hope now is to hope that its accuracy decreases so much that somehow Thunderbolt fails to go. Considering it has like a 100% chance. Oh, wait, it's Thunder Shock. Never mind. You're all good. In fact, it's already getting to the part where it's being unable to hit me properly. It's Thunder Shock. Of course, you wouldn't get Thunderbolt this early. But you can get lucky, I guess. Well, this sucks. This is already turning badly. Okay, this is a level ahead. It should be able to do something, right? If, if this guy can't do it, then my team is finished. Right off the bat. Are you freaking serious? How is this thing so tough? How is it manage? How is it managing this? It's a level lower. 
Yeesh. What kind of things have you been feeding it? Have you been feeding it like, freaking all the all the vitamins that you can get in the game that increase stats permanently? Have you just been feeding it with that non-stop until it couldn't get any higher? Because that is ridiculously OP for what it should be. It's just ridiculous. Even if you do have special defense up. I was using physically based attacks and they were barely doing anything. Whatever. Well, at least my two creatures leveled up. No, I have to go back to Mama now. Sorry. Don't tattle on me to anyone. Yeesh. After all the trouble you gave me, I should, I should tattle all I want. Freaking kid. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. Ah, the water. Whatever, water. I say, can I go through this or not? Jotaro found one ether. Good for me. Good for Jotaro. All right, time to go back to the Pokemon Center and whatnot. Just give me a sec. I caught a Spony, or however you pronounce them. I'm not really sure. Spony are covered by a bizarre sponge-like material. When dropped, they bounce. Okay, that's cool. Would you like to give a nickname? No, I don't believe I'll be using it as part of my team. <coughs> Spoony. Spoony. Holly gained 92 experience points. That's cool. Unfortunately, now I'm gonna have to go back to the Pokemon Center. In case the blinking screen wasn't enough of an indication. She kinda got poisoned in the fight, so... That's no good. I'm gonna have to take care of that right now with another trip to the Pokemon Center. Survive the poison. Okay, good. It's a good thing that, that it's a good thing that it happens because it used to be that poison was extremely devastating, where it would keep zap it would keep sapping their health until they pass out, which is kind of sucky. Can you imagine, like, if you beat your beat a trainer on your last Pokemon, it was at full health, but it got poisoned, and you were far enough away from a Pokemon Center in the Gen One games, or heck, maybe even in the Gen Two games. I don't remember if they had that concept in Pokemon Silver and Gold, but can you imagine that? And you just instantly lost because your Pokemon passed out? I mean, what kind of... That, that would really suck, wouldn't it? Especially considering you wouldn't have lost anyone, but you would still have lost that money. Which is kind of silly. I'm not sure if, it, if that's how it is in later games, either. Ah, okay. I can just get past them. Uh, there, there we go. It contained hidden power! Oh, that guy seems like a gentleman. Oh, wait, what? I swear, I didn't press left. For some reason, he seemed to do it by himself. Maybe I'm imagining things. Ah, okay, here we go. Another wild encounter with the same type of creature. That's cool. You know what? Forget this. I'm just gonna switch out. I'm just gonna burn you. Is that okay? Is that okay, sweetie? Is that okay, princess? I'm just gonna burn you to death. That's okay. I just want to love up Holly. So that she can actually get an electric move and become, you know, legitimately helpful in that type brain in that type area. Otherwise, she's pretty much just a normal type. And normal types aren't very helpful. They're not really super effective against anything. And they're... They're actually weak against... Well, you know, they don't do very much damage against rock and steel. Not to mention, they're weak against fighting types. And they do nothing against ghost types, so... Really. If you don't... If they don't learn any other type of moves, I mean, it seems like they don't have a lot of uses. Unless it just happens to be a very powerful one. Oh. Should have... Oh, a Thunderstone. Okay, that was actually worth it. Oh, okay, there we go. Man, I almost thought she saw me there for a second. Ooh, Tancoon? I don't even know what the heck that is. But I'm gonna try to catch it. Because you gotta catch them all, right? Well, you gotta catch, catch them all. Uh, Star, you can't catch all the Pokemon in your game. You can't catch them, you can't get them all in any one cartridge, or even with trading, because there's some event-only Pokemon that you will never be able to get again after 
after the event's over. So the motto, we've got to catch them all, yeah, that's not going to happen very much, is it? Apparently Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire were especially bad with that because they wouldn't let you catch Pokemon for the previous games. And for the most part, they didn't even have like regions for the other, other Pokemon's regions. So it was extremely hard, if not impossible, I think for, for a, a lot of them in the original Ruby and Sapphire, you straight up had to cheat to get the Pokemon, which is kind of ridiculous if you think about it. I mean, there should be at least a way to get most of the Pokemon in one, one of the games. I mean, if it's going to count that against your Pokedex score. Gotcha! Tenkun was caught! Tenkun's data was added to the Pokedex. Tenkuns are mischievous and are known to steal food from small Pokemon or journeying tra trainers. Would you like to give a nickname? No. No thanks. Ooh, Holly grew a level. Nice. Good for her. Okay, back hill, forest, comet, cave ahead. That's cool. Let's check it out. Oh. Wait. Can that be Rex? Rock smashed? I'm not really sure. No, thank you. Let's go away. Oh. That just makes it instantly succeed, doesn't it? So, let me just take care of something. There we go. I'm guessing... Oh, okay. Oh. That's annoying. These boulders are blocking my way to the forest. I need to get there. Yeah, me too. Well, at least you didn't fight me, so that's a plus. Oh, Ekans. Cool. Nice sprite animation. I'm guessing that was ripped from one of the actual Pokemon games. Or maybe it was made by hand. I mean, I don't know. It, it could have been made by hand. I'm not really sure. Tackle. I want to catch it. Got to catch as many as I can. I'm not going to say catch them. I got, I'm not, I'm not going to say got to catch them all. I'm going to say got to catch as many as I can. Just to point out the fact that you can't catch them all. Because that would be false advertising. And I don't play like that. Okay, bug eating. Why not? <laughs> you don't. You're substantially weaker, but it doesn't really matter anyway because I'm going to catch. I'm going to go for the catch now. Like this. There you go, Ekans. Go on. Stay. I know exactly what I'm gonna call it. Even though I'm not, I'm probably not ever gonna use it. I know exactly what I'm gonna name it anyway. An Ekans curls itself up in a spiral when it rests. The position allows it to quickly respond to an enemy from any direction with a threat from its head. Okay. Yes. Give it a nickname. I know what I'm gonna name it. White. Snake. Okay. For those of you who don't get the reference, it's from Stone Ocean, which is JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Part 6. That's a reference. Look it up. Ah. He's gonna force me to... Well, that's... that's unfortunate. It's always good to do some training in the morning. Well, it's time to test if it was useful. Awesome. Awesome. Black Belt William would like to battle. Black Belt William sends out Bouchon. Good for it. Go, Crazy Diamond, though. Oh, wait. This was probably a bad idea, wasn't it? Yep. It has fighting moves. It is quadruple effective. Dang. Moxie? Its attack rises every time it beats one of mine. Oh, that is not good. That's not good at all. Uh, Magician's Red. You're the more powerful of the two. I gotta beat it and fast. I have to destroy it. Don't even give it a chance. Also, it, it seems like it would burn easily because it's covered in wool. Take that! What do you say now, huh? Okay, monitor. I guess this is the this is the one kind of game where it doesn't really matter if my monitor blacks out. Well, you know, for the most part. There we go. Actually, I think fighting is not very effective against Bug. I'm not sure if it's part fairy or not, unfortunately. Is it part fairy? Well, it's the evolved form, so it might be, seeing as how it learns fairy-type moves. Maybe I should learn more about my creatures. 
Okay, Bug and Fairy. So, if, if my calculations are correct, fighting moves will be doubly worthless against it. Not that it matters. I'll use Charm to try to get its attack down. Yeah, you're getting pumped, all right. Prepare to fall in love. The Mankey's attack harshly fell. And seeing as how it uses physically-based attacks, this is very much going to put me in an advantage. See, look. It can already only do two per swipe. Granted, that can get pretty dicey. Especially if it gets criticals. Are you serious? That's bull. You got two criticals and you hit five times. That's just bad luck right there. Can, can we all be real here? That, that's just luck. That's freaking luck right there. Great. You're gonna get lucky again, right? Oh, okay, because I used Charm again. A critical hit. It did five. Three critical hits in one fury swipe. That is bull crap. And you know it. Or at least that was two. I think it was two. That's bull crap, man. That's bull crap and you know it. You're cheating. This guy's cheating over here. This guy be cheating over here. I hope his attack strength is still low. Because that would be very helpful. Burn, baby burn. Oh boy. Oh boy. Well, I'm in trouble, aren't I? Yeesh. Well, Lone Bray might be able to handle himself. Come on. Jerk? Why do you keep getting criticals? Man, this guy, huh? He keeps attacking first, too, no matter what creature I use. I get that's a level 14, but my creatures... Come on, quit getting critical hits. I know they use focused energy, but that, that's still bullcrap. I'm calling bullcrap right now. Especially getting five consistently. Now this guy's cheating. The AI is clearly cheating. You can't convince me otherwise. You're never going to convince me that the AI totally wasn't cheating here. I'm just saying. Man, the training isn't working. And yet I still manage to win. The more I train, the better a Pokemon trainer I become. And the more you cheat. Dusk Ball. Well, unfortunately, this is one of those times where I'm not Let's Playing at night. Ah, okay, cool. There's Theo. The Pokemon are especially hostile in this cave. They're getting up on trainers. For your own safety, we won't allow you to pass. Is that a bright gym badge? Huh. You must be a strong trainer. However, I don't think I should let you go alone. Hey, why can't I go into this cave? I'm not afraid of any Pokemon. Eh. Wait, I know. Me and Jotaro can tackle the cave together. Isn't that right, Jotaro? Well, uh, okay, I guess so, but be careful. Wow, really? They're gonna force me into this one? My Pokemon almost dead? I'll follow you to the end, then we'll split up. I'll do my best to keep our Pokemon healed. Okay, Darwin was really tough to beat, but my Pokemon gave it their all. Pretty cool, but not as cool as mine. Good for you. Okay, are my Pokemon healed? No, they're not. Dude, you're already failing. My creatures are already weak. Seriously? This sucks. This really sucks. I'm... I'm a little out of my element here. If I am to be so bold. Unfortunately. Okay, cool. I'll poison him for you. You'll have to do the rest yourself because my Pokemon are almost all dead. Wow, I'm surprised that wasn't super effective. I guess it just isn't a flying type. Oh well. Now what? Well, that was was worth a shot, wasn't it? You go after the one you're super effective against, and I'll go after that one. Awesome. Thanks! You're really good at that, aren't you? Pursuit. Nice. Eat poison, bitch. I'm sorry. Use Metal Claw. That's cool. Wait, since this is, since this is a wild 
battle. We can catch it, right? Crap. If my next creature passes out, it's over. It's freaking over, man. And Lombre isn't looking so good either. I'm gonna try to catch it. I wanna see what happens if you try to catch it during a, a team battle. Hey, hey, Theo, you don't mind if I catch this one, right? I don't really care about training it. I just want to fill out the Pokedex. You understand, right? Thanks, buddy. Okay, it was added. Its drill tip tail is used to burrow into the ground backwards. This Pokemon is known to make its nest in complex shapes deep under the ground. It is a drill that will reach into the heavens! Sorry, had to. Ooh, we're to level 16. Fake out. Ooh, nice. Let's see. Makes that hits first and makes the target flinch. It only works for the first turn. That's the unfortunate part, isn't it? Let's see. Uh, I guess I'll switch it with that. Why not? Cause it's a free attack. Right off the bat. You know what? Forget it. I'm leaving. Wait, where are you heading back? I can keep us healed. You're not keeping me healed. You're lying! Oh, okay. Okay, that time you were being serious. You actually did heal them. Thanks. Really appreciate it. I guess that mandatory battle was to make sure that your creatures were strong enough to survive? Because otherwise this would be an unwinnable event, wouldn't it? Well, I mean, I guess they could pass out and you'd appear at a Pokemon Center, but eh. Did you hear that? No, it must have been my imagination. Whatever, man. Jotaro found one poison barb. Maybe I should train. I don't know. I mean, half of my. Let me see my. Let me see the levels of my creatures. 11, 10, 10. Yeah, see, half of my creatures, they're they're just nothing. They've got they've got so low levels they won't be able to keep up. They they're barely up to the level of the first gym. Oh, nice, Rosar. That's what the. So the rock gem had in it. I wouldn't mind catching one of those. Yeah, give me some of that. Yeah, my rival will probably go to, go with that one. Wow, does, does it hit both of us? Ah, speed fell. Crap. Ah, dang it. Bulldoze does affect all of them. That sucks. Well, hopefully that one will be weakened. Okay, good. It only did growl. That's good. As long as you don't do anything that can actually destroy me. Okay. Yeah, knock that one out. Crap. Oh, okay. Yeah, mine's... Never mind. About to say, mine should be able to do something, but apparently not. Let me try this. Okay. Whatever floats your boat, man. Great. Great. Mine mine got knocked out. <laughs> Lucky. Lucky you. Oh, okay. Wow, it knocked your own creature out. I didn't even notice that. Apparently that was the thing. That's what it got hit by. Ah, dang it, I was gonna catch that. Hope you're freaking happy. Hope you're happy, Theo. I was gonna catch it. Fine, just heal my creature. Seriously? Fine, whatever. Wait, oh. oh okay, you did heal it. Never mind. Wow, I'm being too harsh on you, aren't I? Fine, I'll go for the the call the comite. We'll see if that works. Come on. Actually, this may take a while. Come on. Okay, Vine Whip, that works. As long as we're on the same page here. Fusion. Huh. Cool. That's a pretty nice animation. How it actually makes the creature appear to be confused. That's pretty cool. Okay, whichever one it doesn't... Whichever one my rival does not go after, that's the one that I'm going to catch. Because I'm pretty sure my rival is going to end up killing the other one. Killing the one it attacks. 
because I'm, in, I'm attacking that one. Or not, I don't know. This is the unfortunate part. I, part of me is actually hoping that that'll work. Okay. Wait, can you use a Pokemon Pokeball if there's more than one? It's impossible to aim when there are two Pokemon. That's a line, you know it. Fine. Ugh, I don't know. I'm gonna use a move that's gonna be less likely to knock it out because I want one of them. Even though they're bulldozing me, which is no good. You son of a beaver. Oh, you suck. You suck. Fine. Crap. It's, this, it's gonna be the same thing again, ain't it? Your creature's gonna get all the EXP! Heck, freaking glory hog. You are such a glory hog, ain't ya? Okay, I'm gonna attempt to level up my creatures. Hang tight. Now we're talking. Check this out. Look what Holly just learned. Wait, no, go back. Thundershock! Nice! Now this move is useful. Also, it... Now I have a super effective move to use against the flying types. That seem to permeate this cave, somewhat. They're ground and rock types too, but... You know, now I can take care of the... I don't know what it's called. Never mind. The, the bat creature. I can take care of those now. With relative ease! Unfortunately, it's not gonna help me against those. Especially not the Grozard. Because it's a ground type! Run away! The JoJo secret technique! Okay. Heck. Ooh, what the? A Fulrog. That's interesting. Hey, Theo, you go after the... the Grozard, don't go after the... Fulrog, okay? Are we clear on that? Because that's the only one I can't go after. Is Bulldoze a ground move? No, wait, actually it wouldn't matter because it's not an electric type. Yeah, take that. Well, the joke's on you because the speed... our speed is already pretty low. Oh, it's a level 16, that's... that's gonna be a problem. Oh, gee, thanks. Thanks a lot. I thought we had an agreement. You were gonna attack the other one. Oh, crud. Okay. I have to go after the Grozzard, I guess. I'd like to get... I'd like to get the full wrong by itself so I can catch it. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Wouldn't that be... Wouldn't that be lovely? Oh, crud. Okay, good, there we go. See, that's what I wanted you to go after. Thank you. Glad we're on the same page here. Super Sonic Waving! Oh, crap. Holly became confused. Holly is confused. It hurt itself in its confusion. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter anyway, does it? And Holly's hurt by poison. Fantastic. Well, luckily... Theo does seem to have kept his word, and my creatures are, are getting healed after every battle, so there's that. So that's kind of cool. Oh, dang. Crap. Now Orchink... Ah, dang it! Uh -huh. say, okay, Orchink is just gonna... Actually, no. I can call in Stone Ocean, and Stone Ocean will get all the credit, even though it didn't do anything. She didn't even do anything. She's not even going... Oh, never mind. She'll get to attack, but probably won't get the opportunity to go first. Okay, there we go. Screech. Really? Oh, supersonic. Never mind. This again? Well, you can't fool a fairy, I guess. I guess I should be, should be grateful. I get another opportunity to catch it. Gotta catch as many as we can! Pokemon! Come on, catch this time. I'd hate for you to go to waste. You're gonna go to waste, aren't you? You're gonna die! 
Huh. Well, that did something. If the attack missed, buddy. Well, you're gonna die. Oh, not very effective, right. Well, at least now I have another turn. Of course you were gonna hurt yourself in your confusion. It was inevitable at one point. I'm pretty sure that's a contractual obligation. Obligation of every fight, huh? Okay, if this one doesn't catch, I'm just gonna go for the kill. So, forget about it. Shoot, it was so close, too. You are near death! How are you still resisting me? This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. You know, I'm just gonna use string shot. Oh, it doesn't affect... Wait, what? Did I actually use it on my own ally? Now I'm confused. Oh, okay. I just didn't use mine. I don't get it. I don't get it. Something weird must have happened. Throw a Pokeball. Oh yeah, does String Shot affect all Pokemon, including allies? That's probably it. Well, how many of these things do I have to... There we go, finally! Yeesh. I was gonna have to waste all my freaking Pokeballs on that one. Fullerog can't swim, but they need to remain damp to survive, so they are found in grasslands next to rivers and lakes. Okay. You need to remain damp, but you can't swim. That seems like a defect to me. Just saying. Go to level 11, that's not too bad. Full heal! Of course it's a bug type, so it's not gonna remain useful forever. No thanks. I'm just gonna go. I don't feel like fighting right now. Bye bye. See ya. Arriba Jerichi. Jojiro found one HP up! Jojiro was quite fortunate to have found that. Jojiro found a great ball! Not just a regular ball, a great ball! This is gonna be great. Oh, nice! Two flying types! Are they flying type? <laughs> wow, I, I, I honestly do not know the, the types of my own creatures. Nope, it's just poison. That, that's kind of stupid, though. That means that a ground-type move would be super effective against it. Even though it's it's clearly has, it clearly has wings. Am I the only one who doesn't- who can't figure that out? Who doesn't understand that? Am I the only one who's confused here? Holly is already poisoned, you dope. Whatever, I'll just use charge and then thundershock ya. Holly began charging power! Holy special defense rose. And of course, I'm gonna get hurt by the poison. That's how it always goes. Shocking. How about some shock therapy? Holly's already poisoned. Are you that stupid? Okay. I take it back. I kind of wish you were still that stupid. That would have been better. I was better off. Ah, nice. Your attack rose. Seriously, that seems like it should be super effective. Just saying. I know I'm probably just being very bitter about that, very salty, but yeah, it doesn't make any sense to me. It should be part flying. I mean, if you're not gonna make it part flying, why, are you, why did you give it wings to begin with? You do know that's not very effective. Well, you got it anyway, so that's something. Hooray! Not that mine's super effective either, but still, at least it's not resistant. At least it's not resisting it. Specifically. Ah, your attack missed. Yeah, see, Metal Claw is much better. Also, it, it has a chance to increase your attack, so the next time it'll be even more powerful. You need to use that. Just spam it. Spam it all you can. Lick. You are one freaky enemy, aren't you? You got wings, even though you're not a flying type. You got a fox tail, and apparently you like to lick stuff. I mean, is there anything that isn't weird about you? Huh? Yeah, whatever. You know what? I don't feel like fighting this time. I'm just gonna go. Holly's run away. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna take a little intermission. Hang out real quick. 
Okay, I'm back. Although, let's face it, you guys didn't no really notice any difference anyway because it was instantaneous on your end. But that's beside the point. Jotaro found one Dusk Stone. Nice. Give me all them evolutionary stones, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. give me all them stones. Okay, cool. Too bad I don't have Lombre out. Or, stupid, yeah, yeah, it is called Lombre. I had to make sure. Too bad I didn't have Lombre out from the beginning. I need to, she's bubbling, destroy them. It's like Surf, except it, it won't hurt my ally. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Well, your biggest mistake was underestimating Lombre. That's gonna come back to haunt you, you can be sure of that. Oh, okay. Okay, that that that's cool too. That's cool too. But, hey, we we get the I get the EXP regardless, so it doesn't really matter, does it? Wow, now you're trying to put my my accuracy down. Maybe you would have been better off just hitting the same one twice. Or maybe you knew exactly what you were doing because now neither one of us are attacking. Well, that's unfortunate. Now you're attack now you're going after our attack power. This might be a bit of a bit of a misstep. Huh. I should probably do something about that, shouldn't I? It's super effective. Bubble bubble toil and trouble. Yeah. What do you think of that? There we go. Ooh, Holly grew to level 14. They grow up so fast. Oh nice! Evolution time! Evolution time! Evolution! Okay. Your Holly has evolved into Kinet Monk! Oh, they grow up so fast, don't they? If I was Joseph, I would be so proud. <laughs> well, I see we just stumbled into a rock concert. I'll just, I'll just see myself out, okay? Holly's run away. Apparently that guarantees a runaway no matter what. That's cool. Oh boy, Th there's something up ahead. Why don't you go and see? Okay. Well, you're following me like a lost puppy, so it's, it's on both of us. I don't feel like fighting these guys, so uh, uh, I'm gonna run away. I think my team is beefed up enough to handle whatever's ahead. Theoretically. Possibly. Probably. That Shrimmer was nothing. We finally made it to the end! Oh boy. Let me guess. Caven. Gonna separate us. Yep. How did I freaking know? Probably because he backed off at the right moment. Ah, okay. What the? Hey, quit causing those cave-ins, you jerk! Oh great, now I have to fight. Uh, okay. I wasn't expecting that, a level 22 monster? I'm gonna beat that. Well, I probably can, but still. Oh, crud. Well, I better get its attack strength down before I die. Is Holly now a part lightning? Yep. Part electric. Holly has now become weak against ground. That's unfortunate. I was kind of hoping she'd remain... Oh well, I guess at least she's resistant to electric. Not there are many that that would apply to, right? Let's go with bubble. Gotta get its speed down. Oh boy. Crap, its speed didn't go down at all, did it? I gotta get speed down. Come on, get speed down, get speed down. Get the speed to go down. Crap, it's not going down, is it? Dang it. Oh, this is... This is turning into a one-sided fight, isn't it? This is very unfortunate. Alright, that's not a flying type. That's not a flying type. I don't have anything that is immune to... Ground attacks. In fact, three of my three of my creatures are weak to it, including the one I'm picking right now. 
The only reason I'm picky is because the one that I have aside from that is just too weak to do anything indoor. Brace itself? Why would you need to brace yourself? That barely did anything. Maybe I should have used Mud Slap or Steel Claw. You know, I'm gonna use Mud Slap. I'm gonna try to get its accuracy down. It's like Sand Attack. If you spam that and you get it, it's accuracy low. Accuracy low enough, it won't be able to, to attack with anything. That is the plan. I gotta make it so that it can't attack me. Go ahead, keep keep using Growl. I hope you keep using it. Keep using Growl until Growl no longer hits me. It ain't anything on me. Keep using it. You're gonna keep using a door? That's kind of stupid now. Actually, can I catch this? That would be great. Maybe I should use the great ball for that. Nice! The attack missed. See, this is what happens when you when you mess around too much. You've been messing around too much that you gave me multiple opportunities to, to decrease your accuracy. And now you can't do a, do a darn thing to me. You're helpless. Ha ha. You suck. You suck. You may have all the power you want, but you don't know how to use it, that's for sure. Oh, after all this, you couldn't. You can't even use that awesome power of yours, can you? It's all gonna miss. I'm just gonna drain you slowly until you're low enough for me to catch. That's the that's the plan right there. Okay, so obviously it's not gonna miss all the time, but it's gonna miss enough times that I should be able to beat you. Theoretically. See, attack pissed. Thankfully that also has a chance to lower your defense, so that'll make my attacks deal more damage too. You gotta love these fighting type moves that make themselves more powerful each turn. Either because they increase your attack or they decrease the opponent's de defense. It's so cool, isn't it? It missed. Come on, get that crap out of here. Okay, let's see if it's weak enough. I'm not gonna use the Great Ball just yet. Okay, so it is possible to catch it. The question is, will it remain in its ball? Come on, come on. Dang it! Dang it, Bobby! Wow, maybe I should have attacked then. That way, I would have been guaranteed to not knock it out. I'm gonna try one more Pokeball. If it doesn't work, I'm gonna go with the Great Ball. Because it was so close with the regular Pokeball. Which means if it's that close with the regular, maybe the Great Ball will do it. It's just my logic. Ha ha! You can't hit a thing! The only thing you actually managed to hit me since I started using Mud Slap, his growl. And what good's that done you? You serious? Are you are you even being serious right now? Fine. I guess I'll have to risk knocking it out. I'd hate I hate to have to do that, but what what choice is it giving me, huh? I mean, I guess I can try using all my Pokeballs against it. Okay. I'm pretty sure the next move is gonna knock it out. So, I gotta, I gotta catch it. I have to be able to, come on! That's even worse than it was before. How is that even possible? Are you serious? Are you even being serious right now? Come on. Come on, just be caught, man. There we go. Actually, it's a girl, but whatever. Shh, don't let them know. It's actually a very powerful creature. Oh, and it's a dragon too! Nice! Man, I'm prone to argument that they ever managed to coordinate it all as a miracle. Now I kind of want to add it to my team, but what should I call it? Hmm, what's a good female stand user? Maybe Stone Ocean because it's a rock type? And I'll just replace that? Sorry, Stone Ocean, current, current Stone Ocean. Wait, I just removed the space. That's actually a better way of doing it anyway. It's way too powerful to ignore. Nice! That was pretty cool. 
Hmm. You there! What happened to all the Pokemon that were going berserk? They calmed down. What? You fought a Turland? Those are really dangerous. Hmm. That may be the problem. When a Turland's two heads fight with each other, it riles up other Pokemon in the area. Thanks for bringing peace to the cave. Now we trainers can get through without fear. No problem, sir. Always happy to help. It's too bad I couldn't immediately add it to my party. How awesome would that have been? Frustration. Wow, I use that move all the time. Like right now. Route 5. That's all cool. Ooh, Bashon. Nice. Can't escape. You serious? No, no. You better not. I will find another creature and I will destroy you. If you knock Crazy Diamond out, that is it. You better believe I will unleash hell on you. And then some. Ah, I see. Wait, what waste the town? Gotta figure that out. <laughs> Wait, where's the map? Alright, that's just my card. Pokepod. <laughs> oh, there's the map. Okay. Yeah, that way just goes to the, the waterway. This way is to get to the town. Also, there's a professor there, too. Or is that just the same one? Found a revive. Nice. Hopefully I can revive my dead co comedic skills and my dead gameplay skills. A lot of things could use resurrecting right now. Did you know Tander was formed by two volcanoes? Both are dormant now. So the region championship takes place over one of them. Cool. I've lived in Rockvale town since I was a little girl. The mountains are rough to live in, true, but I'm hale and hearty as any young lass. Foo, foo, foo. Cute. It's amazing how the economy functions when half the population of a given region are trainers. Trainers who don't work. How would we ever feed ourselves if we didn't have Pokemon to help? Good thing we have Pokemon to serve as... Willing servants. Definitely willing service. Servants, quote unquote. I should probably get out my new ground type, my ground dragon. That's freaking awesome. Ordinarily, having two creatures that are weak against water would be a bad thing, but it's part dragon. So it takes care of that weakness. Okay, sorry. Sorry, bug fairy. But I'm gonna have to let you go. That's just the way it's gonna have to be. Don't be, don't be too hard. Don't take it too hard. Don't take it too personal. But this, it looks like each one also looks, looks like a Charizard's head, so that's even cooler. That's just awesome, ain't it? Okay. Save. I got a dragon, mofos. Of course, the fairy type was made specifically to kill dragons, which is funny. Welcome to Rockfowl. Watch for falling boulders. Okay, thanks. Happy for that. When I was young, I lived in the big city. Now I just like living here in the quiet countryside. Okay. That's all cool. Huh. Ooh, look who it is. Jotaro! How I'd expect it. It's good to see you, mate. But unfortunately, now is the best time. Should I make him sound like an Australian since he says mate? It's good to see you, mate. Maybe I'll make him sound like... Crap, what's his name? Jace from Team Four Star from Dragon Ball Z Abridged. Oi, it's good to see you, mate, but unfortunately now's not the best time. There's been an emergency at Cypress Labs. We're all incredibly flustered, so I went to try and do something. Although actually running into you now might have been the lucky break we need. I can't explain here, how about you come back with me to the lab? I'll introduce you to Professor Cypress, and she'll give you the lowdown on what's happened. Follow me, mate. Oh, I do a terrible Australian accent, don't I? <laughs> Maybe I'll just use the surfer bro again. Ernest, you're back! Did you find the thief? Is it this kid? Listen, kid, you picked the wrong lab to break into last night! Whoa, what's going on here? Huh? Wait, Lily, hold on! This ain't the thief! This is Jotaro, my research assistant! Yeah! He gives me my pot! I mean, I'm, I'm kidding. They happen to be passing through town! They're Pokemon trainer. 
They? I'm a he. Hmm, a Pokemon trainer, are you trustworthy? Of course they are, they're my assistant, ain't they? Besides, the father is Kellen, the Ranger Chief. Aha! Uh -huh. So you're Kellen's child, huh? Well, I suppose I can trust you. I'm Lily Cypress, the professor, Pokemon professor at this lab. You better trust me. Because if I know these games well enough, I'm pretty much the only hope you've got. Because all of the adults tend to be in completely incompetent in these games. It's always up to a ten-year-old boy to save the world. You probably figured out what's going on by now. Last night when we were out, someone broke into the lab. They stole many of the Pokemon we were keeping here for research. But it's strange, they completely ignored the most valuable thing in here. There on the table, the prototype Pokemon Speech Translator. It's a cutting-edge technology we've been developing. There are some who would go to great lengths to get their hands on it. That's what's got us baffled. Why would someone break in if they weren't going to steal the PST? You're upset that it didn't get stolen? <laughs> You're back! What did you find? I managed to recover one of the stolen Pokemon. This fellow was hanging out on Route, route 06. This is excellent! I have an idea! Yeah, let's use the PS2 on Oten to find out more about the thief! Oten! Ah! Scary! So scary! Was that my Pokeball asleep suddenly and moving, but not human friend? Taking me and others out towards Mountain Cave, dropped my Pokeball and got free. Towards the Mountain Cave? That must be on Route 06! Maybe the thief is still there, with the rest of the stolen Pokemon. This is a good lead, something to give that Pokemon a treat for its hard work. Now the question is, how do we catch this thief? They've got the stolen Pokemon on them, so they could be dangerous. Jotaro can help, they're a Pokemon trainer. They even have two badges already. Is that so? In that case, Jotaro, you might be exactly who we need. According to Oten, the thief is still on Route, route 06 to the west. If you'd look into it, we'd all be in your debt. In order to help with your investigation, oh I know. Why don't you power the prototype PST? That way you can talk to any other Pokemon you find to help locate the thief. Can I talk to my Pokemon? Please be quick, we're all counting on you. Okay. Cool. <laughs> what happens if I try to use it? Or will it not let me use it? I'm just gonna try. <laughs> Wherever it is. It's probably in key items, yep. Oh, I can't. Okay, I guess I can't use it willy-nilly. Don't panic, don't panic, everything's gonna be fine, right? I'm a fossil rev revivification expert. However, now is not the time. We're in a state of emergency! Okay, jeez, cool. Well, time to find a thief, I guess. I mean, I just caught a pretty powerful creature. I'm pretty sure it'll help if I gotta use it. I'd rather just... Okay, at this point, Bug Eden is by far the weakest, so... I should probably beef it up and then inevitably replace it, because that's what I always do. Oh, but there are friends! You treat your Pokemon with love and respect as you toss them aside when they get too weak. Seriously, you get to play as a complete jerk. Those kids in their video games, when I was a kid, we played outside in the dirt, and we liked it! I'm training my Pokemon on my game. I'm gonna beat my sister at someday. Wow, oh, jeez. Way to cut off my path. I'm playing with my with my brother. Don't interrupt. What's this? Is it a PS3? Or is that a Nintendo Wii U? A black Wii U. <laughs> One day, my son tried to go into Comet Cave to catch his own Pokemon. I had to drag him back. Okay. It's kind of weird how this, how this game has a Pokemon game in it. The cousin over there is crazy about Pokemon, but he never leaves the house. Wish he'd get a job. Are you a trainer? Don't you? Do you have Pokeballs filled with Pokemon? Yeah. Hello, I'm a Pokemon enthusiast. I see you're a trainer. Perhaps you can help me. I'm looking for one Pokemon in particular. I just can't remember what it's called. If you can help me, I'll give you a reward. There's some sort of fat yellow snake. What was it? I don't have that in my team. No, I don't think it's what I was looking for. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't have what you're looking for. Sorry. Oh, whoops. Yeah, I probably should keep doing that. Huh, it's raining. Using a weather system. And it wasn't raining before, so... Unless that's an event thing. Are you a trainer? Sweet, listen, would you be interested in a trade? I'm looking for a Tufferang. If you have one, I'll trade you my Palich for it. Sorry, I don't have that. I don't think, anyway. Have I even seen that? 
I should probably figure out what it is. Oh, is that it? Yeah, I haven't caught it, though. I've only seen it. Ah, that's why, because it evolves. Right. Well, I've obtained 23 creatures, so that's... That's pretty good. At least I think so. Oh, wait. Where's the lab again? Oh, wait, it was up there, wasn't it? I want to... Actually, I want to see if he'll evaluate my Pokedex. Because that would be... Lovely. Of course, I'll probably just talk about the thievery. I know you probably didn't expect me dragging this so suddenly, but Lily Cypress is my good friend and research partner. Couldn't just stand by and do nothing, man. In fact, you showed up. When you did, it feels like fate. According to Oten, the thief is hiding out in the mountain cave on Ruto 6. Please find them quickly. Our continuing research depends on it. Are you going to apologize for treating for treating me like a pariah? Or, I think that's the right term. Like a pariah? Are you going to apologize for just accusing me of being the thief right off the bat without even getting to know me first? Come on. That's just messed up. Okay. Yeah, I already talked to her. Hard to tell who you're talking to because they share the same sprites. Well, I didn't talk to that guy. Much of the mountains around here is said to be impassable. However, I am determined to scale them. Yeah! Do not forget to bring some potions. It's very long. Fantastic. I'm glad. I'm happy for that. But look! Tin tin! No humans allowed! Wow, really? You serious? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's just funny. That's just funny to me. Well, now I have a creature that's super effective against flying types, so... You're in trouble, buddy! You are in trouble! You're gonna wish you hadn't done that! Because you are finished! You're as good as gone! Yeah! Let's see how you feel about... Let's see how you feel about trainers after I do this. Or about humans after this. Okay. Holly, show them what happens to people who discriminate against trainers. Against humans. Kill all humans. Must kill all humans. It's super effective. The wild Oten fainted. Bug Eaton gained 62 experience points. Holly gained 62 experience points. Okay, is this one getting me more friendly? Tin Tin. No humans allowed. You too? Why not? Oh yeah. It said the th did that didn't that other one say the thief wasn't a human? It was a non-human thief. So whoever the thief is is convincing the Pokemon to turn against their owners? I don't know. I don't know how that works. Fine. Use all the charm you want. It won't really matter because I'm pretty sure Thundershock is a special attack. Which means it don't matter. It don't matter about a thing. Try nothing but a thing. Take that. It's super effective. It's super effective. Oh, crap. Are you okay, Holly? Holly, use Thundershock. Holly appears to be doing just fine. It's super effective. Ooh, bugging grew to level 11. My weakest creature is up to level 11. That's not too bad. Actually, that is pretty bad. It's pretty bad, but not too bad. Okay, let me find something to heal you with. Fresh water. With high mineral content. Okay, that was probably a waste of that, but... Hey, what are you gonna do? Pretty sure the super potion would have been an even bigger waste. Somehow. You found a super potion! What do you know? Speak of the devil. I immediately find one. Tintin! No humans allowed! Tintin! No humans allowed! Yeah. Look at it. Trying to act adorable. Trying to act all help, all innocent. But I know it's real intent. It's not gonna work, buddy. What'd I just say? What did I just say, buddy? Little buddy? I believe I just said, that's not gonna work on me. So of course you use quick attack. Because you're cheap. 
You cheap. Get out of my sight, you cheap skate. Get out of my sight. Nice. That's a lot. Ow, oh, Oten. Judge, where use the PST? How dare you try to take me away? Take this! What? What did I do? Wait, are they convinced that I'm the thief? Wow, everyone's accusing me of being a thief these days, aren't they? What did I do to deserve this? Huh? Holly was identified. Holly was identified as the one who will kill you. Whoa, level 18. And yet I've almost completely destroyed it. Wow, the level 18 one is even less capable. That, that's kind of sad in a way. I thought one of my Pokemon is up to a full over level 20. It's, I can't tell if that's a good thing or not. Okay, I'm pretty sure the thief is in here. Where are you? What the? Are you the one? Onion man? What? Garlic! Gar garlic! Okay, use the PST. What are you doing in here, human? Are you trying to enslave these Pokemon again? They've been freed from your clutches. They won't be your prisoners anymore. Gorilla Kid is here. The Pokemon hero. I found them in that horrible human place and I liberated them. We'll fight for our freedom. Dude, really? It's gonna be one of those things? Gorilla Kid? Wait, you're a Pokemon that uses Pokemon to fight? That's just weird. I can't be the only one who thinks that's weird. Phone Lunapop breaks the mold. What does it really matter? Nothing really matters to me. I don't even know what it's... Oh. Well, that explains it. It's got to be at least part ground type. Crap. Dang it. Well, that means I just got to use Lombre. Right? I mean, if I have to, I'll use my super powerful dragon. Don't make me do that. It'll wreck you. It'll turn you into soup. Well, that did some damage. Absorb. Let me get some of that health back. It's super effective. Nice. The foe had its HP drained. It's not very effective though. Although you did you did lower my speed, so well done, I guess. Jerk. Jerk! I call foul! I call foul. Dang it. Well, this ain't good. Well, crud. My only hope now is to... Actually, it doesn't matter, because even if I did lower its speed, it just lowered my speed, so I'd, we'd be in the same boat, wouldn't we? Except I can use that. Nice. That is in minion. What's that? Okay. Cool. That's cute. But since it's a poison type, I know the perfect thing to use against it. A ground type. I'm gonna grind you into paste. You gotta love how... The, seriously, those two heads look just like Charizard. That is cool. Magnitude. My creature is magnitudes ahead of yours. <laughs> Sorry. Had to do it. The pun was just begging for me to say it. Lumbre grew to level 17. But Chef? Well, this creature's pretty OP anyway. Oh, okay. Magnitude. Use it again. Magnitude 5. Not too bad. Could be better. Could be worse. Oh, okay. Right, it's the fighting type. Well, it doesn't matter because ground is not weak against fighting types. If it was part rock, you would actually have the advantage, but this is one of the few times where I'm glad it doesn't. Stomp? Seriously? That's all you got? Okay. Use another magnitude. Okay, good. This one will knock you out for sure. Knockout blow! Cool. Prepare to be destroyed! Gar... Lee... We... We lost, but how? Why do these Pokemon fight on behalf of humans? Don't they want their freedom? No, it's called being friends with them. 
They're your friends? That's impossible! Pokemon and humans cannot coexist! Says who? Says who? You're controlling them? You jerk. Comrades, you're going back to that place? Why? Grr, you'll pay for this human! As long as there are Pokemon that are being held against their will, I, Garly Kid, the Pokemon hero, will be there to save them. I'll be back. Whatever, you weirdo. It contained torment! Well, that's a good, that's a good TM move right there. Just torture them. Huh. That's not ethically unsound at all! <laughs> nope, no ambiguity there! Wait, did I just pass by the TMs, didn't I? I wanna see what that does. The user torments and enrages the foe, making it incapable of using the same move twice in a row. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That way, once it uses a move, it can't use it multiple times. That way, if there's a move that's super effective against your creatures, it won't be able to use it a second time and rampage you. It'll have to switch things up. You owe me an apology! Jotaro, you did it! We managed to recover all the missing Pokémon thanks to you! We followed behind you in case you needed backup, but you did great! We saw everything that happened! Did any of you see a tiny green man in a costume run by just now? It was a man, it was a Pokémon! Our thief was actually a Pokémon called Gurlikid! They're incredibly rare, I haven't heard of one being sighted in many years! Its habitat is in a remote spot in the mountains, so it doesn't encounter humans often. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if that one has never encountered people before. Garlic Kid has a strong sense of justice. It must have seen the Pokemon in the lab and thought they were we were keeping the prisoner. I suppose they attacked because they were just excited. Perhaps Garlic Kid has a point, though. From now on, we'll make sure our Pokemon have more freedom and we'll listen to them more closely. Speaking of, as a field test for the Pokemon Speech Translator, I'd say this was a resounding success. I can see it becoming a very useful tool in the hands of a Pokemon trainer. So as thanks for all that you've done for us, why don't you keep the prototype PST? This is bound to give us some great field data. Just be careful with it, all right? We wouldn't want it to fall into the wrong hands. If you need anything, we'll be back at the lab. Until next time! Well, aren't you gonna apologize for treating me like a thief? You jerk! Jotaro, if this were a test, I'd say you passed with flying colors. You showed great int intuition and resourcefulness. I'd say you're well on your way to becoming a full-fledged trainer, mate! Oh yeah, before I forget, I have an item for you that will help you on your journey. Obtain EXP share. Oh, this is gonna be good. This is where this is where it gets really good. It will gain experience even when it doesn't participate in the battle. Keep catching Pokemon and growing stronger. Your next gym badge is in Beale Beach City, right? It's a long trek, so you'd better stock up before your journey. Happy travels, I'm rooting for you. Now I'm gonna head home to Maki Town. Let's fly, Pidgey! Wow, he really is a dude, bro. Let's fly, Pidgey! Yeah! Bruh! Yeah! Sorry. That's gonna kill my throat. Anyway. Yeah. I mean, I can kind of get why people would have a problem with the, with the EXP share in Pokemon X and Y. Or I guess in the in the newer ones after that. All, well, all the 3DS Pokemon games. Because it gives all of your Pokemon EXP and you don't have to really switch it around ever. But, eh. You know, it cuts down on the the tediousness of it, I guess you could say, of, of grinding, but I, but then again, that is the whole point of an RPG, so that'd be like saying that in a first-person shooter, you get to cut down on the, on the shooting, I guess. I don't know what I'm saying. The holder gets a share of the battle's EXP without battling. I'm definitely going to give it to Bug Eaton. Oh, definitely needs it. Although, I'm probably going to replace Bug Eaton with a flying, with a proper flying type at some point. Well, I don't need to right now because I don't even have a have to fly HM move, so it doesn't really matter anyway. Even if it couldn't learn H, even if it, could, if it couldn't learn fly, and I'm not entirely convinced that is the case, or that it that it is the case that it can't learn fly. Oh well. Oh well, it's all good. Okay, I took care of that. Watch for falling boulders. Uh, okay, there. I guess there is a gem in this in this little town. Oh, whoops. Yeah, Pokepad, that's what I want. Map. Okay. Legion Town. Beal Beach City, that's what I want. Ooh, department store and a casino. Huh, this one actually has gambling. Although, let's face it, the Pokemon series still has gambling in it. 
This is just more upfront about it. You know what they have gambling for? If you win, you gain, their, you get some of the trainer's money. If they win, they get some of your money. What's the difference between that and gambling? I'd like to know that. Can someone explain to me the difference between a Pokemon fight where you bet money on it and a casino? At least a casino is more upfront about it. I mean, although I guess, to be fair, you could claim that it's skill-based, whereas casino games tend to be luck-based, but, eh. Okay, she wasn't gonna move. Like, who are you? You're kinda cute. Love that shirt, just love it. Oh, wanna battle? Okay. Cool. Last Wilma would like to battle. Wilma! Wilma! Sit Flaffy! Go Holly! Sorry, but now I have the I have the need to say Wilma! Whenever the name shows up. Holly used charge. Holly began charging power. Zappy Zappy! I'm gonna shock ya. Oh. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot it's an electric type too. You know what that means? Forget this! I'm gonna use my twin snake! Oh, do stop smoking. Yes, solid snake and liquid snake. <laughs> That's funny. It doesn't affect you. Well, too bad. So sad. But I know something that's gonna work plenty. My twin-headed Charizard is gonna use a ground move. It's super effective. You're seriously gonna charge again? I've already switched out to a ground type. You should know how stupid this is. If you if you know anything about Pokemon and type advantages, you'd probably know why this was a bad idea. Not that it matters because they beat you before you had a chance to. Luna Pop, what even is that? Oh right, that. Ugh. I thought Luna Pop breaks the mold. Good for you. I don't really care. I don't care. I don't care. Nice. Bulldoze. Fine. Yeah, it's no skin off my nose. I mean, I'm, I'm four levels ahead of you. I mean, it's gonna take a while for it to bridge the speed gap. And by then, you'll probably be knocked out anyway, so what, what difference does it make? Look at that. Okay. Your attack rose. It's too bad this isn't a wild battle. Otherwise, this would be perfect. Really? Really? Okay. That's pointless, you know that, right? I mean, I was just gonna attack you next turn anyway. You were as good as gone anyway. I love EXP share. Ah, I've been bested! Hey, cutie, wanna trade numbers? I know a tough trainer when I see one. Registered last Wilma! In the Pokepod! Can you pronounce? I can. Yeah, I can pronounce things. I'm pronouncing things right now. Jojo found for TM43. It contains secret. P Wait, did that say secret powder? No, I'm pretty sure it said something else. I was reading that wrong. Yep, to this. Let me see. I think it. I think it actually said sweet something. No, it was secret power. Man, I need to quit doubting myself. It was secret power. I don't know why. I thought it said sweet. Part of me thought it said sweet, but I guess I realized it said secret. I don't know. My brain just does not agree with me sometimes. Oh, nice. Let's see. How far away am I? Yeesh. I'm quite a long ways away still. They weren't lying when they said this would be a long route. Found one full heal. I would go into battles, but... I don't feel like it. I mean, I'm almost out of time for this Let's Play, and I kind of want to get as close to the town as possible, if you know what I mean. I already have one of you. Go away. Shoot. Shoot. Go away. Go away. You bother me. Good thing Holly has that runaway thing. It makes escaping from wild creatures pretty much guaranteed. Oh, yeah, it's to the left. Well, I already had one of you, and I kind of already gave it up. So, you think I'm gonna catch a new one? Get out of here. Oh, I just realized something. Crap, what is that, uh... 
What is that, uh, light, that electric legendary beast in Gold and Silver and in, in the subsequent ones? I think it was called Raikou. I just noticed that my creature kind of looks like Raikou and its special abilities to run away. Wild Holly fled. It used Mean Look. You're not getting away. Wild Raikou fled. It contained Recycle. I forgot what that did. I know it did something. I, I think I remember that in X and Y. But I forgot what it did. Let's get a crash course, shall we? Shall we? Recycles a single use item. Oh, right. That can be very helpful if it's a if it's a rare item. If it's a very rare item that can come in handy. You know, like some kind of berry. Actually, I don't think those exist. I was about to say maybe a berry that heals all of the Pokemon's HP, but I don't think that's possible. Okay, I, I wasn't gonna get out of this without getting into a fight. Come, my child, freely I will give you lessons of the mind and body. That sounds... that sounds wrong. Expert Benjamin would like to battle! Oh, he's not a kooky old man, he's... he's actually... a hermit? An expert hermit? Because he's using a hermit crab? That's actually a coconut crab. You'll never beat me because why? I'm too shiny! Like the... Like a sunken pirate wreck. Scrub the deck and make it look shiny! Crap. I better, I better switch out. Crap. I can't. I'm stuck. I'm stuck like this. Tackle. Hey, yeah. Well, at least I did some damage to you. Super effective. You, you suck. You sack. Go lombre. See how you deal with this. I'm too shiny. Come on. Scrub the deck and make it look shiny. I don't know some of the lyrics. I'm. I can't think of them off the top of my head, at least. Let's see. What am I thinking of? Hurt by sand too. Crap. Let's see. Little mouth man. Get the hook. Get it? You don't swing it like you used to, man. Although I have to give you credit for my start. And your tattoos on the outside. But just like you, I make myself a living work of art. I never hide, I can't, I'm too shiny. I don't know the rest of the words. I don't know. I don't know the words when he does, I'm too shiny against Maui. Wow, you're, you're part grass? Oh, right, that would explain a lot, wouldn't it? Ah, I get it, you're grounded grass. I guess that makes sense. Even though it's a weird combination. Mankey! Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna beat the crap out of your monkey. Or your monkey's gonna beat the crap out of me. Either way. Fred. Well, that's unfortunate, isn't it? Oh well, I've got Stone Ocean. I'm good. <laughs> It's my trump card. Unless there, you have a creature that's super effective against it, in which case it becomes my biggest weakness. But your Mankey is not one of them. Fury swipes. Really? Man, what is it with Mankeys and their obsessive need to scratch people in the face multiple times? That sucks. Magnitude 9, baby. Magnitude 9. Oh, you are finished now, aren't you? Nice. That was a very valuable step in your development. I'm not gonna make him sound like a decrepit old man. I'm gonna make him sound like a master. Win or lose, every battle pushes you further. Remember this always. Thanks, sir. Okay, there we go. I have to go through the cave first? I don't remember that being on the map. Oh, I, I went too far. Whoops! Whoops a doodle. Well, I messed up, didn't I? I went the wrong way. I knew I should have taken a left twin at Albuquerque. Okay, where where am I on the map now? Okay, according to this I have to go straight north. But there is no path straight north. So the 
the heck? Do I have to go through that waterfall to go straight there? I forget it. I'll, I'll figure it out on the next video. That's it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like lily pads and waterfalls. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out. Have a good one. And have a nice and pleasant day. Gotta catch a mostly Pokemon.